story of the game and, and Quinn's performance. You know, Quinn was uh, terrific. You know, and, you know, we knew he would still shoot. And, you know, the, the 0 for 11 in the last game is, you know, not indicative of how he played. He had 14 assists. You know, we told him during practice, you play great and you can shoot. You've been shooting well. So, you know, he showed the maturity of not trying to make up for 0 for 11, but just play his game. And I thought that was, you know, that's a big game. Not the, the number of points and assists and lack of turnovers is huge, but coming off of 0 for 11, I, I really love that, that uh, he was so good in that, in that regard. Uh, Ryan hurt his foot. We don't know the extent. It's the same foot. Uh, he's being, you know, he'll have to do a, a CAT scan and x-rays and all that. Uh, but we don't know the extent of the injury. You know, as soon as we find out that tomorrow, you know, we'll put some word out. Uh, we're hopeful that it's, that it's not real serious. Uh, but for precautionary reasons, we felt that it wasn't uh, good to play him in the second half. And uh, our bench came through. I thought Josh, Emil, and Murph, all, all three of them, really contributed uh, greatly uh, to the win. Um, it was just a hard game to score uh, in. Uh, and uh, thank goodness our, our defense was a little bit better than theirs tonight. And um, again, we only gave up the three assists. You know, it's just, you know, we have to keep playing defense like that. So, any questions? Do you know when Ryan tweaked it? Well, I, I don't know the moment. Yeah, I, I thought towards the end, when we put him in for the last play, when we had the you know the last play you know, to get shooters in for the last shot, one uh, one of the assistants told me, you know, his foot's hurt, and but he had already I already put him in, and uh, the other thing is he probably <coughs> still take a shot with the, with the foot like that. He isn't going to play defense. But uh, that's when I found out about it. So something must have happened like in the last couple minutes of the first half. How much of the offensive struggles in the first half was them and how much of it was you guys? No, I think, you know, most of it is them. Yeah, they're a good defensive team. And, uh, you know, we're a good defensive team. There was, you know, we did miss some open shots. And... Yeah, you know, when you miss free throws too, like Rashid made a really good play, and um, you know, he missed his free throws. And I, you know, he's still a younger guy. He's quite great. Still a younger <coughs> guy. You know, I think if he hits his free throws, he gets 18 points tonight. Yeah, you know, I mean, he, he uh, he's not seeing the ball go in right now. And I think as soon as he sees it go in, he'll he'll come back. He's playing pretty well. But uh, he's having a hard time, you know, uh, scoring. And you know, they were really all over Seth. Uh, you know, weren't going to let him get anything. And then they didn't have to double Mason. You know, Booker. I mean, Booker's good. I mean, Booker's he's one of the better players in the league. And he could. He could. They were both playing each other one on one, and kind of a, was a, a wash, really. You know, I mean. Uh, um, Kind of a wash there. You know, Mason's defensive rebounding is spectacular. He, he, he just had a hard time scoring in the first half.